Hi, everyone. My name is JJ Gutierrez. I'm a consultant here at Key Performance Ideas. Uh, we are the leading implementer for EPM and cloud services. And so today I will be doing a simple walkthrough of the simplified and mobile-ready interface in planning and budgeting cloud service. When PPCS was first introduced, uh, it used the classic interface that you see up here, uh, but then quickly transitioned to a more simplified interface. Um, and it's gone through a few different iterations, but today I will be reviewing the latest iteration, which actually made, made the simplified interface a lot easier to use. And one thing to note, for all of you have, who have been using PBCS for, before July 31st of 2016, you have the ability to switch to the simplified interface or the standard interface, as most of you already know. However, if you're new to PBCS, um, the simplified interface is going to be the standard, the simplified interface is going to be the only interface that you guys will have access to. And so I think this demo will be key to you guys to understand kind of the differences between the simplified and the classic interface and where to find things. And so when you log on to your system, you'll see the screen here and you'll see the bottom on the bottom left corner here, simplified interface. So I click on Simplified Interface, and it will bring up um, the new Simplified Interface. So just kind of walking through the screen here, it's pretty, pretty similar to the classic interface. Um, in terms of your left pane here, you have activity. And so the activity here basically describes your task list that assigned to you from a user perspective, and also tells you what recent activities or recent um, data forms that you've opened, and also favorites. And so this, this look here and this screen here is similar to the, the, similar to the classic interface where you have these options as well. Um, and then next thing I'm going to point out is up here you have the home button. And so when you're navigating through the classic uh, in simplified interface, all you have to do is click on the home button and that will take you back to this screen. Um, that, I, I think this, that's really key in navigating the simplified interface because a lot of the times you're going to walk through different screens and you might not have a, an easy way out. And so the home button here is a good way to take you back and reset yourself. All right. The next thing I wanted to walk through here is up here you have your username. And in, in, your, in, in your username you have this drop down. And the nice thing about the drop down here is it immediately tells you things that uh, it gives you the ability to, to do downloads. And that's one thing that uh, people always ask me, all right, where do I get my software? Where do I get SmartView? Where do I get the, where, 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 do, I, where do I download all, all of my um, EPM Automate software? So you click on Downloads, and it'll bring up the download screen. And so you have the ability to get the planning admin extension to do metadata management. Like I said, SmartView, predictive planning. Uh, SR over the web, and EPM Automate. So finding the downloads and finding the different tools that you need and the clients that you need to help support um, PVCS, is, uh, uh, they, made it, they made it a lot easier to find because it's immediately in your username. And another, another nice thing uh, about this drop down here is the About feature. So when you hit About, it's going to take you to your usual uh, legal notes, and then the version that you're on. But the nice thing about um, when you click on the version you're on, if you click on the actual number, it'll pop up and it will take you to um, notes for that particular version. And so you can easily navigate through the documentation, kind of understand what's new in this version. And you know, as, we, as, as you all know, that PBCS is constantly updating, and so we're getting, we're getting updates every, every so often. And so you can understand what, what the latest version is and what, what the new features are. All right, so the next thing I wanted to talk about were the navigation cards. And these, this, from a user perspective, this is where most of your users uh, are going to be access the things they need to do in PBCS. So here you have tasks, which are equivalent to task lists, um, dashboards, which are, new to, uh, which are new to PBCS and not, and not in the classic interface, um, you have your data, and so from a data form perspective, um, if you click on the data card, 
This will bring up your data forms. Um, and so the nice thing about this version of the simplified interface is that it organizes it in folders similar to what you would see uh, over, um, over in the classic interface. And so you can kind of organize things through folders. You have the ability, to, like you did in the classic interface, to secure these things by assigning permission. Um, and so a lot of the functionality you had before is pretty much here in this setup now. Okay, so if I want to go back, you notice here when I clicked on data, uh, it actually brought up the, the cards that, that, that were associated with that line. And so here, they've, the navigation changes. And so, uh, like I said before, it's nice to be able to go back and click here and go to the home button and take you back and reset, reset, re reset your screen to basically the, the, the home page. All right, so another, another good user, as, uh, user aspect uh, of PVCS is, from a user perspective, is accessing reports. So we click on reports. And here, basically, it's going to take a, a second to come up because it's going to regenerate that screen that we saw before. Up here, we're back into it. We're back into our different navigation here. You got your task, dashboards, data, and then the reports. And so here, you can see it's basically just a list of reports. And you have the ability to run them which, uh, via HTML or a PDF. The nice thing about this new version of the simplified interface, or newer version of the simplified interface, is that you have the ability to change your view into a tree view. And so here, from this tree view, now you have the ability to organize reports in folders, um, group things together, um, manage what the end user sees. Things are a little bit cleaner in terms of how reports are organized and also um, how users access reports. And so this is a nice, uh, nice new feature, or a newer feature in, 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 PBC, in the PBCS simplified interface, the ability to organize things and view them in trees. All right, so sticking in this, in this screen setup, the, another, another user function is the ability to launch rules. And so here, we click on rules, and as the screen regenerates here, the user will have the ability to launch rules that they have access to. Um, if you're an administrator, you have the ability to secure rules, assign permissions, um, who has access to run to run rules. And so pretty much here, the, the nice thing about this workflow or this flow is that uh, everything's kind of in one screen. So you can kind of switch from your forms to your reports to your rules, and from an end user perspective, um, they kind of get everything they need in one big shot, rather than having to jump through different icons or just jump through different menus. Uh, the nice thing about the simplified interface is that I, th I, I think it, it makes navigating things and switching, switching around from different objects once you find them pretty easy. And another thing you can also do from, a, from an administrator standpoint, is you can manage uh, these cards that they that displays up that display up this display up top. And so, if you don't want them to see dashboards or tasks, and you just want them to see data, reports, and rules, um, you have the ability to change that in your navigation flow. Um, and then, one thing that I like about PBCS is or PBS simple, the simplified interface is that it has this academy button. And so this Academy button will also take you to um, different videos they have on PBCS. So if you want your users to um, see some, or listen to some pre-built or listen to some pre pre-built videos, they have the ability to kind of self-train themselves. And then also, if you're an administrator, they, they they have tips and tricks here for you guys as well. And so from a user perspective. Um, these are the key things that I that I have people ask me all the time about. Where, where is that in the or where where is that in the simplified interface, and how do I find it? Now let's move on to uh, administrative tasks. And so the admin, a lot of the administrator tasks are accessed up here in the navigator. And so when we click on the navigator, you can see here we've got a whole bunch of different menus. Um, so the first the first one I want to go over here is the application. Uh, the application section and in, in the overview. So 
One of the key things that most administrators, uh, at least I had a hard time finding, was the ability to uh, refresh your cube. And so in the overview section, if you go to Actions, you have the ability to refresh your database right here. And so the, 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 if you click on that, click on Refresh Database, it'll take you to the screen. And then you, you have to, you hit the difference here is you have to create a refresh. Um, and so you can just click on refresh and then it will refresh your application. And so that's how you access the refresh um, database portion. Um, another question I get a lot is, um, what if I want my users if I, uh, to switch to the standard interface or the simplified interface to be the default? Here you have the UI display, and in the UI display, you have the ability to switch simplified interface or standard interface um, as the default for when users log into the system. And so again, these are for folks, this ability is there for folks who have ad, had access before July 31st of 2016, uh, according to the Oracle documentation. And so if, you, if, you, if you're new to PBCS and new, new to, at, or new to PBCS, you, you won't have this, you won't have this display and then you will be, you will have to use the simplified interface. Another question I get from folks is like, how do I change, how do I edit, how do I edit forms or how do I manage my dimensions? And so if you go to Navigator here, you have the same create and manage menu similar to what you saw in the uh, classic interface. Um, so if you click on dimensions, and give it a, give it a second here to load up. Now, this screen should look familiar. This is the classic um, classic interface screen. And so nothing in here has really changed. Um, so from a managing dimension standpoint and from a screen uh, standpoint, it's just where you access it has changed. And so you can do the same things you did before here. Okay, so now, now I'm, I'm gonna switch to, how do I find, how do I edit rule, or how do I edit forms? So if I go to, same thing, go up to the navigator and forms, Click on the forms here, and this is going to bring up the same menu that you saw in the classic interface, the ability to edit your forms. Again, here, so if I go here in my folders and I go into demo, um, you have the ability to edit forms. Again, same interface as before, uh, just accessing it in a, in a different spot. And then the other thing that I get all the time is, how do I access um, my rules? How do how do I make changes to to, to my calc, to my calc scripts or to my business rules or calc manager rules? So if you go to Navigator, you go to Rules. So again, here it's it's regenerating the. Um, the calc manager screen that you see from the, the the simplified interface, or from the classic interface in the simplified form. So again, if we go and we open up our application, we see our databases, and then again here, all of this is similar to the classic view in that you have the same screen, it's just accessed differently. And then one thing from a PBCS standpoint that I get all the time is how do I how do I see my um, how do I see my database properties? And so, then, so if I click on my main applet, the main database here, I can go into actions and database properties. And this is going to take me to my different applications. And I just have to find my main application here, click on my main application. And this will load up your database properties. Here, here you can basically see um, your dimensionality, then sparse, uh, your stats, 
and transactions, all the stuff you used to see before. So I'm going to close out on that. And so basically your navigator gives you access to all of the different administrative functions that you used to see in the classic, uh, the classic interface in one big shot. So if you're doing a lot of admin, if you're going to administer the system, most of your tasks are going to be in this navigator, uh, navigator area. And um, this is where I would go first to, to kind of just look for any, any administrative tasks that you're looking to do. So again, I click back to the home screen. Again, the simplified interface, uh, this, this, at least this iteration, iteration uh, they've really done a good job of kind of navigating the, the flow of uh, PVCS. I believe things are easier to, act, are easier to find uh, in this version of the simplified interface, especially with the, the, them organizing things in folders and giving users access um, and being able to change the, the cards that uh, the users can see. So there's a lot more customization that can take place. All right, so that concludes my presentation on the new simplified and mobile-ready interface. Thank you, and have a good day.